Perfect. So this is just a regular crow reel in elbow mode? Okay. Is it based on the same three beat structure thing? No, this is just a two beat. So like one, two, one, two, okay. one, two. Right? And then if you add in the reverse direction, if you add an extra beat, so like there's this thing, there's an infinite sort of like one like this. Alright, so two, one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. So the one that we were doing uses that. Spinning this way for me. So this is my reverse side and this is my forward side. So um, this hand's motion breakdown is um, starting from here. You're like in this pressing chop sort of position. You s sort of stretch your chest forward and pull your elbow this way, like this. And then scoop your hand in. And it's like that plate trick, you know? So you scoop your hand in. And then there's a circle right here. You like join, it's like a cul-de-sac, I guess. So you come in, join it, and then leave like that. So. Like that. And then it kind of drops and then comes up right at the end. So it's like, rah, rah, rah. Okay. And then the forwards hand, um, you think you imagine that there's like a a cylinder in like in your belly right here, and you treat it like a half pipe. So um, this hand comes across, it sort of falls down from the elbow like a tentacle or something, goes up, and then enters the half pipe, goes up out, sort of a pressing up and out, and then comes back, and then flips over and serves out like that. And then again collapses down and sort of out a little bit. Comes up, enters the half pipe, goes up, back, flips out, serve like that. And then you synchronize the two um, from uh, this position right, right here, roughly. So you're, you're in that pressing, chopping position with your reverse hand. Your forward hand, forward hand is has just come come over and up like this. So this hand rolls down into the half pipe and pulls your elbow and then goes up and your, your forward hand goes up into the half pipe and it's going to come up and flip over like that simultaneously this hand is entering its cul-de-sac thing and there's this overlapping moment like that it's sort of so like that What's the, where's the circle part of it? so the circle right here yeah. so it comes in and then this hand's going in like that, and hands overlap, okay, like that. So, so it's you're, you're like this, like this. Like this hand presses out in the half pipe, comes around, and then when it flips up to serve out, this hand is doing its snake thing, okay. And then you go out, and then right here. Um, this hand has gone like this, and it's going to go up, and this hand is here, and it collapses down and overlaps on top like this, so it sort of drops down, and then you end up here, and then boom, so half pipe, back, pump back, back, so, So there's these moments that you kind of learn to like to practice um, the overlaps and stuff. And, um, and then I may as well show you the turn because you're, you know. Sure. <laughs> so the turn, um, when you go out and you're on your way back like this, instead of, um, like this hand sort of leads for a second and then this hand catches back up and then it goes out to its normal position. Um, you 
you allow this hand to continue leading. So instead of this, and then that, it goes like this. This hand comes up. And this hand goes out like that. So it looks like this, right? And the turn happens right here. This hand comes back, drops down. And yeah, exactly. It's making a cube like that. So you can do it from this side. So like that. And then right here, this hand is going to flip over, and that's when you get that pull. And you step forward, and now you're doing it the other way. So, like from here, that, and then there, and then right here, this hand flips over, and now I'm back where I started. Like that. So. And you can do it infinitely. Too. Like, um, so the one that I've been showing you is split same reverse crow, right? So the, the, the dominant direction is facing in the reverse, like this, right? Um, where the reverse side gets two beats behind the back and one in the front. So one, two, three. And uh, this gets one, and then two, three, one. Two, three, like that. So it gets the forward side gets one in the back and two in the front. The reverse side gets two in the back and one in the front. And when you switch it, you have a split same forwards crow. So two in the back and one in the front versus one in the back and two in the front. So I'm not too good at this one yet, but um, it looks kind of like this. And then the turn is sort of similar, but it's not quite. Fabulous. Uh, and then there's split up, right? Um, and I'm not too good at this one yet, but this is the, the forwards, split up forwards. Um, and there's so so this one, they're they're both going forwards, right? So you ha you're doing it. Um, it's the half pipe one. Oh, they're both half pipes. Yeah. Like okay. That. So, like that. And it's really challenging. I'm not particularly big fan of it. But the uh, reverse split up reverse yeah. is really cool. That's the bo double call to sec? Yeah, yeah. I like the double call to sec. Yeah. So the way each direction has its own thing kind of reminds me of snaking. Yeah, yeah. Perfect weekend. So. That's super cool. That's what you're trying to show me at uh, at Flo Show, that I didn't understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Okay. Um, so. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna stop this video. <laughs>